Like and subscribe and click the bell icon to get new video updates. Accused dialer dealer enabler allegedly sold a lame Dean crime gang and Comanchero bikies thousands of black market SIM cards. A phone store manager has been accused of selling thousands of SIM cards to a drug syndicate as police target organized crime enablers. The 30-year-old was arrested in Granville, in Sydney S West on Friday and charged with 30 offences including dishonestly obtaining financial advantage by deception and assisting and deriving a material benefit from a criminal group. Police will allege he sold thousands of pre-subscribed and fraudulent SIM cards to Sydney criminals, including those linked to the syndicate. Plus Six View Gallery A phone store manager has been accused of selling thousands of SIM cards to a drug syndicate as police target organised crime enablers Plus Six View Gallery The Sydney Cider has been charged with 30 offences including dishonestly obtaining financial advantage by deception and assisting and deriving a material benefit from a criminal group His arrest comes as police turn their attention to the alleged enablers and facilitators of organised crime as accused high-ranking figures flee the country or await their day in court following a series of raids. The men who we arrested earlier this week could not have facilitated their ongoing criminal exploits without the help of enablers and trusted insiders, Detective Superintendent Grant Taylor said on Friday. Investigators are working our way down the pyramid and we've a still got plenty more to come. Raids throughout the week have targeted members of the Dialer Dealer Syndicate Police allege was linked to the Elaine Dean crime gang selling drugs supplied by Comanchero Spikies. Eighteen men, all believed to be low- and mid-level associates of the Elaine Dean crew, were arrested on Tuesday morning after a 450-strong team of police officers raided 29 properties across the city of southwest. The action is the result of a 10-month undercover operation by Strike Force Sugarcane, coordinated with Torsk Force Erebus, recently established to target organized crime amid a spate of public place shootings. Plus Six View Gallery Police will allege he sold thousands of pre-subscribed and fraudulent SIM cards to Sydney criminals, including those linked to the syndicate Plus Six View Gallery. His arrest comes as police turn their attention to the enablers and facilitators of organized crime as high-ranking figures have fled the country or are awaiting their day in court following a series of raids. Encrypted phones seized were allegedly a source of competition in the drug market as dealers competed for lucrative clientele and police believe they may have played a part in a number of murders over the past two years. The arrested men will be charged with crimes including drug supply, firearm, dealing with the proceeds of crime and direct or participate in a criminal group. Law enforcement has cracked down heavily on organized crime this week with NSW Police Commissioner Karen Webb saying she was confident police had cut the head off the snake, shutting down the syndicate altogether. She said those arrested on Tuesday didn't appear to be employed but displayed considerable wealth. Plus Six View Gallery The Sydney phone shop manager was arrested as police zero in on organised crime enablers.